Excellent. Excellent job, Youngblood Hawk. Thanks for being here. Thanks for having us. Welcome back to Portland. It's nice to be back. Welcome back home, kind of, sort of. Yeah. yeah. We'll talk about that in a second. Oh, homecoming. Mom's here and everything. The yeah. tour starts tonight uh, with Keen. The show is over at the Crystal Ballroom. We had Keen in here earlier. I don't know if you guys knew oh, that cool. or not. They had a lot of mean things to say about you guys. I'm sure. <laughs> they hate us. I'm kidding, of course. Already? <laughs> have you even met? Have you had a chance to hang out with them yet? I don't know how we, that works out. We haven't met them yet, but we're very. I think in a couple hours we'll meet them. Yeah. Okay. So hopefully. Don't tell them that I said that you. They said mean things about you. We Not saw, that that's gonna come up. <laughs> that guy said. Uh, we saw him play at South by last year. Um, so I'm super stoked to meet him. Yeah. No, they're really talented. They did. A, I mean, they're obviously very good at what they do. They did a great job today. Have fun on tour with them. Mm -hmm. Opening night, nonetheless, yeah. right here in Portland, which is great. So you're an LA-based band, yet nobody's really from there. Is that kind of sort of correct? That is correct. Yeah. Where's everybody from? Just go ahead and one by one. Where's everybody from? Um, San Antonio, Texas. Okay. San Antonio, Texas. All right. I'm from San Antonio, Texas as well. <laughs> oh, okay. Uh, Washington, D.C. Omar? Uh, I'm actually from yeah. L.A. Yeah. L.A.? Oh, so one, one from L.A. Yeah. And you, sir? From Portland. Yeah. All right! <laughs> Beaverton? Yeah, Beaverton. Team, team Beaverton? Yeah. Any Beaverton? Any Beaverton people out here? There you go. Yeah. Don't, don't be afraid. <laughs> so, uh, Sam and Simon, raise your hands. I want to make, okay. So you guys were in a band before, and then that band is 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 decided to call it quits. Yes, a little okay. hiatus for eternity. So <laughs> tell me about the the <laughs> the closing of that chapter, and then how that formed into this new chapter with Young Blood Hawk. Um, yeah, it was just one of those. You know, we were in the other band for close to seven years, and you know, we gave our whole lives to it, and we had some success. We had like a top five single in the UK, and uh, but it just really wasn't the music that. We wanted at the to make time, yeah, yeah, it was close to our hearts, and um, so you know, there's some inner relationship things that come along with being in a band, and it was just time to move on, and uh, so we just completely started over after after all that time, and just started writing songs together in his little homemade studio, and uh, just kind of evolved naturally, and we these are all our best friends, you know, we've known each other like they grew up together, and so it was just like a, a natural fit to have these guys play in the band, and they're all like the most talented musicians I've ever been around so it was just a natural fit and it's been quite a ride for the last year and a half yeah i bet it has been so you just based on phone calls let's get everybody together or how did you plot and scheme these specific <laughs> people well basically yeah we, we, we made like a six song demo and we sent it to all of them and tasso was living in florida quit his job like moved the next week to la i mean they just all really believed in it and yeah. so um yeah we we had we had played in you know various incarnations of different bands with everybody here so it just made sense for everybody to play together, you know? It worked out well, and it's going well. Absolutely. Yeah, we're having a lot of fun. The EP is out. It's We Come Running, and the song, obviously, it's very done very well. It's an amazing song. How did the idea come together? For those of you who don't know, there's a, a children's choir that sings on this album. Yeah. Was that, how was that put into the song? Was that thought of before, long after? I think we wrote the song, and, you know, we'd, we'd been wanting to figure out a way to incorporate a children's choir in... Uh, in one of our songs and we thought the message of the song and you know kind of the way that you think when you're a kid really pertain to each other you know following your dreams and not really letting anything stand in your way and kind of lifting yourself you know forward and and you know when you're a kid you think you know I could be an astronaut or a you know detective, detective or anything. rock star yeah anything yeah. and so and so you know it, it kind of made sense to us to have children in the song to really enhance that message like Pink Floyd did it, we can do it. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> and then uh, I, I get a chance to see you. Have you had a chance to perform with them other than on Leno? Was Leno the other night. Did you guys see him on Leno? Just say yes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. That was our first time uh, performing with them. Yeah, yeah, that was great. And they're just like, they're so good. So professional, yeah. you know. Way more professional yeah. than us. <laughs> <laughs> Not my kids. <laughs> no, man. All right, so uh, you guys will play some more for us, yeah? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, so grab their EP. Any plans on making an LP, a long play for those? Yes, uh, there's our, our full-length record will be coming out the first week of March. Okay, cool. Yeah, so, we've already finished it, and yeah. we're so excited to release it. Awesome. Yeah. All right, so uh, see them tonight at the Crystal. I'll shut up, and they will play some Who? more. Oh, Young Who, Blood Who's Hawk. coming tonight, anybody? All right, yeah. all right. We're going to have some fun. It gets a little wilder than this.